Hey, what's up? Welcome to Top 5. Uh, I'm Lynette 28, and in Top 5, we're going to talk about the top 5 reasons something or something, something or something, you know what? Something or something is awesome and or happening. So, this episode, Top 5 Reasons Why Winter Isn't Going Away Anytime Soon. And guess what? It's all your fault. Alright, now, reason number 5. Y'all wished for it. Everybody, everywhere, is always like, God, I wish I had a brief winter for snow. I want snow. Snow, snow, snow. But that only happens in the summer. And you know what? Winter comes, and guess what? It's fucking cold. You bitch about it as soon as it happens. You blamed it. It's your fault. You wished for it. Stop wishing for snow, and it won't be cold in the winter. Or, be more specific, I wish for snow for Christmas. I wish for snow for this day or that day. Don't fucking wish for snow in general. Alright, reason number four. No game releases. This is pretty obvious. Now, think about it this way. If there's a game released, people run their consoles. And look at the PS4. Sold 6 million consoles. 6 million consoles playing a game, let's say, uh, Infamous Second Son, which is coming out soon, so it will be over then. But, it's not now. No game releases. So let's use it for Netflix. Fan doesn't run, doesn't generate any heat. More games released, more heat generated by the consoles. Winter storms no longer happen. Tornadoes, yeah, because you got weird heat fluctuations, but different story, we're talking about winter. Alright, reason number three. Response time. Zero. He ain't got none. Looking at you, Georgia, specifically. Alright, like one inch of snow when the kids are locked into school forever? Not okay, brother. Um, only state capable of handling the cold winters, like this one, Florida. You know why? All the old people from the north, like Wisconsin, went down there. And in Wisconsin, in the words of Andy Bierstack himself, It's snowing like a motherfucker outside right now, and motherfuckers snow a lot. I don't... I don't know if you know about that, but uh, in the early in the early 1920s, uh, motherfuckers used to snow a lot. Like a lot. I'm talking like 30 feet of snow per motherfucker. So it's like that outside. Um, yeah, 10 feet of snow per motherfucker out there. So when they look, old people get one inch, they're like, "Bitch, please, this is nothing." All right, reason number two. We're counting down, not up. Ice cube effect. Now check out this graph. Okay, the world. It's a world. Now when there's snow, it's cold. It's ice cube effect. The more snow there is, the colder it gets. You may think it's easier, or not as cold. See, it's not what I wanted to say. I wanted to say not as cold. Fuck you, Chase. You may think it's not as cold because of the ice and snow out there. But in reality, it's just as cold. You've just been like all brain hooblad. Ice cube effect. Science, it happens. Now, reason number one. Now I'm going to roll this clip, and you're going to understand why this is reason number one. Okay? No, 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 none of that. See, that's what it is. Frozen, Oscar winning movie. But, you know what this music says? The song got so popular, generated covers, probably gonna get me views because I'm talking about it. Let it go, okay? Now, words say, and I quote, but I'm not gonna say them, so I'm gonna put them. Uh, the <laughs> Ray John, the <laughs> that's about him, anyways. You know what you're doing? You're pissing off Mother Nature. Knock it off. As soon as that song fades away, we're gonna have summer. It's gonna be nice and warm. As soon as these top five things are gone, winter will be over. So, follow my advice and just stop. Take the snow, take a flamethrower to it. Stop watching Frozen. It's a good movie watching in the summer when you bitch about the heat. Get ready, Georgia. And uh, release games. Titanfall coming out, buy that game. And the Xbox One, because it's good. But I'm not being endorsed. No, no endorsements here. Just buy it. Good game. And uh, yeah, see you sometime for top five. Please subscribe for more top five and stuff.